What a surprise! <coughs> yeah, I'm just f***ing around with the camera. We are at outside our current share house where we're in 2022, as we know. It wasn't planned, okay? We wanted to do a project looking at our personal ghosts. We wanted to use the tools of paranormal research and investigation to do that. Thing is, mm. we're having a few odd things happen yes. <laughs> in the share situation, in this building we share. We've got an apartment each, and mm. we've both been using Ghost Tube, yep. getting the same words. Yeah, so we... Only recently just did a ghost tube inside the kitchen space. Mm. And literally within the first first few seconds of ghost tube opening up, we get the word basement. Mm. Just wondering in the house here, is there anybody that would like to speak? Basement. Could you um, give us a little bit more to work with? We're trying to understand this <laughs> message you're giving us without going insane. So we're actually sitting right outside. That's right. Um, the house. <laughs> Be <laughs> because as you see, we have a convention now of having these conversations. That's right. Because the car itself reveals its own mysteries. We also don't know still whether Whatever's in the house has been following us in the car. Yes. So is it in the car with us? Yeah. So we've both been getting the word basement yeah. and we both got the question, where is it? Yeah. So we've launched into investigating on site, mm. like a genuine investigation. Yeah. Is it haunted? I then had an incident involving a soup spoon. <laughs> yes. Which I I don't actually know how to explain, and it's so ludicrous. Yes. And you can watch that uh, via Fiona's Ghost. I go on and on about project. it. Project. So, worry. yes. A spoon I even, disappeared, and then it turned up again. Yeah, I opened the spoon drawer, and it wasn't there. And the next day, yeah. it was there. So, hmm. so the reason we're investigating our own sort of living yeah. slash studio spaces for this year, which we've been, you know, as per the history of Fiona and I, as you will probably discover throughout these episodes, we find ourselves landed inside these spaces together, experiencing sort of unusual occurrences <laughs> and our own sort of complex, you know, histories of men. Men and, <laughs> and ghosts, it turns men out. Men and ghosts. Men and ghosts. Yeah, men and ghosts. Yeah. Well, that could be the uh, alternative title for this project. True. We decided after getting the word basement that we would conduct an Estes method, mm. uh, which I uh, was on the headphones and Fiona was the interviewer, and you will see that in a minute. Yep. But I wonder why we're just here. It's worth running a ghost tube session just to see what comes up. For any spirits that are following us, or are located in that dwelling. Okay, I'm just recording. To come and join us in the car because we don't know if we know you. We, we think you might know us. Mm. Um, is it a new spirit? Is it a new presence in this house? I don't know about the I mean, just keep recalibrating Ghost Tube. There. And I'm just setting another Ghost Tube session to okay. run. You've been communicating with us in the past, in the house. Mm. If you've got anything to tell us inside here, we would appreciate it. I'm Jason. I'm Fiona. And just for the viewer, there is a basement in this building. Mm. We can't access it because it's in the front half of the building that we don't have. Um, that's not our part of the building. Mm -hmm. But there is a basement. I've just spotted the door, actually, so we might get a shot of the door to the basement. Oh. Do you see at the top of the stairs? I do. Yeah, that's the door to the basement. Ah. So we'll show you that oh. in, in okay. now. We'll show you that entrance. So I'm just looking at the the door to the basement is not so far from being directly under my bedroom window. Yeah, yeah. And f not mm. far, pretty much behind the wall Yeah. from where we did the another Estes method. Well, the Estes method that we'll show you. 
interesting. Mm. Sometimes it's as interesting, the silence from the apps. Mm. Well, I don't know. We've I... now filmed a few of these sessions in cars and actually at the time we don't notice things happening and it's only when we review the footage that we're starting to oh, yes. notice odd things. Yes, yes, actually, we've had some weird anomalies. Part of why Orbs. we're wondering if someone's here with us. It's actually a very strange place to be doing but any no. of this because it's we're basically in a big electrical box. Apparently, oh my god, apparently we are. Or it's sitting on my lap again. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, yes, it does go off on Fiona. Does it go off on me? Let's hope so. Not as much. <laughs> yeah, well, it did. No. Is it still going off on me? No, no. not now. Okay. Good. Oh, no, there it goes. Oh, well, that might be because oh, it's close to... Look, well, okay, I don't think we're getting much through yeah. ghost tubes. So we'll just let you watch this Estes method because it's fascinating uh, to see what comes through after we had the word basement. It's me. Hello. Welcome. My name's Fiona. This is Jason that you're speaking to. We're trying to establish communication with you. How are you? Shit. Not good then. Um, okay. Is there any way that we can help you? Do you have a name? Would you like to introduce yourself? Stop. Stop. Would you like me to stop? What would you like me to stop doing? It's above. It's above, okay, because you keep mentioning the basement, which is where we're sitting. You said it. I, did I say it? Okay, I did say it. It's above. Attic, games. Okay, do you mean earlier when I talked about how babies were suffocated, babies were being killed in South Australia? I'd just like to point to there is a device sitting on the piano that if you go near that, by the way, that will be another way you can let us Was know. Was it a boy? I, oh, okay. I don't know. I'm sorry, but it could have been a boy. Was it your baby? Did someone take a baby away from you? Disturbed. Noise. Disturbed noise. Well, we can relate to that. Sure. Disturbed. Did they say you were disturbed? You. Me. Oh, I am definitely disturbed. Believe me. <laughs> we both feel disturbed. Me what? Bring it. What would you like me to bring? I'd like to help. I'm going to do my best to understand. I'm not sure what I can bring for you. Are you talking to me or are you reliving a memory? Voices. Were you hearing voices? Did you live in this house? Left to right. Left to right. Both ears or... I'm sorry, I'm not quite sure I understand what left to right might mean for you. What do you want? I want to get to know you and to understand why you're here and what you're trying to communicate to us. Liar. It's true, I would like to understand. Why do you think I'm lying about that? Oh, hello? Are you standing near Jason? Would you like to... Oh, hello. Welcome. I can Do see... Do some research. Okay. Could... Is there something to do the research on? By the way, thank you. I don't know if I managed to catch it on the camera. Okay. Okay, 
I, I that's what I do I am actually a professional researcher thank you for coming near that device I appreciate it and thank you for appearing on camera with Jason hello again it's complex it always is especially if it's about it's she it's she 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 yeah I'm, I'm getting the feeling you're a woman how about I give you a sense of what I feel I'm hearing I feel as though there was a woman in this house that you might be the woman that you had some emotional issues isn't it I live through it. Okay, you live through it. You live, you do live or you lived through it? Um, I assume a difficult time. Okay. Okay. Did you, could you possibly give me... It's a depression. Yeah. Often, sometimes really severe depression and feeling disturbed can lead to hearing voices. And when that happens... I'm going to speak. Please do. That's what Jason's there for. You can speak to him through that device. Yeah. Yep. You can also stand next to him again. And you can also sit near the piano, as you did. I saw that you were here. You're welcome to be here. I hope you don't mind that we are here in this house with you. Did you live in this house? Find it. I know you've asked us to look for it. Something you lost in the basement? Could you tell me what I'm looking for? You've got two. You've got two. I've got two. Was a, was a crime committed here? Or, or one? You've got one, two. It's about power. Yeah, I'll bet. Were people wielding power over you? Isn't it? Isn't it? Yeah, it is. It often is about power. Defeated. Did you feel defeated? Did they defeat you? One of them. One of them, do you mean one of them was responsible for what happened to you? Has something bad happened here in this house? My... Yeah. Stupid. Arms forward. Arms forward. It's rubbish. Um, Hello. I'm going to ask again because often. I know that... I'm just thinking over it. Okay. Okay. Keep thinking over it because sometimes when really bad things happen to us, and especially if it causes our death, we tend to leave. Ling linger in a place. You would like us to leave or you would like to leave. Or you are unable to you. leave. Me. You would like me to leave. Would you like me to leave the basement? like right now 
you like. I'm just adjusting for the sake of the camera. I'm going to stand outside the basement room. I can't leave this house now for a while. Do you think we could live in peace together? That costs it's done. Is it? What's done? Would you like to stand near Jason again? Or go stand near the piano? He doesn't mind. <laughs> it's bizarre. Oh, it is bizarre. I bet it looks bizarre. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. It's not meant to be like that. Not meant to be like that. What's that? What's, what's it meant to be like? Are you talking to me? Okay, I'm going to pull Jason out. You're getting in the way. Oh, am I getting in the way? Okay, <laughs> I'll step back. I think it is time to... Did it help? I don't know. Did it help? Are you talking to us? Is it? No. Courage. Uh, we'd all like a little more of that. It's a young girl. Is it? Does she have a name? And did she live here? Sarah? Is it Sarah? Or Doris? Asleep. Was a young girl asleep here? And something She's happened? got it. What has she got? I kind of want to, I kind of want it. She's got it, but you kind of want it. I can understand that. Do you know this Barbara. girl? Barbara. Barbara. Her name was Barbara. And was Barbara in this house with you? Help. Leave it alone. Please. I'm getting a sense of almost a sibling. A rock. Fiona. Oh, that's me. Do you know me? Do you know me? Why me? Why? Why me? <laughs> Why? Hydroponics. Okay, hydroponics. Yep. Never really looked into it, but... You're wrong. Oh, yeah, possibly. I mean, I thought about growing lettuces. I know that hydroponics is often how people grow marijuana. What's going on there? Oh, what is going on? <laughs> I don't fucking know. Um, did you stop... What is it? I, what is it? Indeed, what is it? Were drugs being grown on this property? Was something naughty going on in this basement? The floor. Yeah, we noticed the floor. We noticed that there's a problem with the floor. It, uh, I'm just pointing the camera there for a moment. Around. It's still warm. Is it now? Oh, God. <laughs> Please tell me it's not a body. <laughs> I'm there's a, a principle about pulling people out of Estes method. So, dad. Oh, dad. Oh, you're not my father, are you? He's drunk. Well, he would be. <laughs> Actually, oh, maybe that is my Tom. dad. 
Tom. I yes, I have a. You can feel it. Okay, can you? I know a Tom. That's a. We share a father. Dads. Oh, this is just fascinating. Um, I'll be honest. I don't know if this is to do with me and my family or not. You gotta ask him. Ask him what? Okay, are you Bruce? Are you Bruce Sprott? Ooh, growling man, a growling man. Okay, no. Test him. Okay, I don't know who you are um, and what you want. What do you want? What is your name? We talked. Did we? Did you and I talk? I'm Frank. The ground. Again, the ground. Uh, is there something buried in the ground here? Who are you? You're Frank. There's Barbara. Oh, God. Okay, so just for the sake of the camera, we had a Frank, we had a Barbara. These were people who taught us at university, by the way. So if this is about Jason and I, roughly. names might be familiar. Roughly. Okay, I'm going to... I'm going to pull Jason out of this. Oh, am I? <gasps> just pulling you out, just pulling you out, because... Oh, my God, what's his name? Okay. Yeah, well, <laughs> um, there's, a, there's a fundamental principle about I'm meant to pull you out after 15 yes. minutes. And, and because... Okay, this is going off the phone and rails. Basement.